In this experiment, we are going to see how we can make a series connection. A series connection has only one loop, so the same current flows through all the elements in series. For example, I am attaching this battery to this buzzer first. Make sure this red end goes to the bigger leg of the buzzer. The other end goes to the LED. And again, make sure the red end goes to the bigger leg of the LED. The other end of the LED goes to our motor. And finally, the remaining end of the motor goes to the battery's negative end. As soon as I connect this, current will flow through all these elements in series. As the current is very low, the LED will be very dim and the buzzer will sound only a little and the motor will not rotate. We can see the motor is not rotating, the LED is dimly lit and the buzzer is making very little sound. So this is a series connection which has only one loop to carry electricity and all the elements are getting the same amount of current. In this experiment, we are going to see how to make a parallel connection. In a parallel connection, the elements have their individual loops. For example, I am attaching this motor to this buzzer. The buzzer and the motor are now in parallel connection because both of their ends are commonly connected. Now, I am going to attach this LED in parallel also. Finally, if I attach this battery to this parallel combination, the elements will start working. Here, I have attached a zener diode so that the direction of the current does not get reversed. This is the negative end of the battery and this is the positive end of the battery. The bigger leg of the LED should be with the positive side of the battery. The same thing goes for the buzzer. Now I am connecting the battery. We can see that the motor is rotating, the buzzer is making sound and the LED has lighted up. So this is how parallel connection works. The elements have their individual loops. Current is passing through the LED and another current is passing through this buzzer and another current is passing through this motor. So in a parallel connection, the elements have their own individual currents.